another week over long day for me today. I actually worked 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. Long day. 12 hours. And, um, crud. I think I logged back in after after lunch. I hope I did. If not, I'll have to have uh, Katie fix it on Tuesday. Monday, Tuesday, whatever. Um, so, yeah, it was a weird day. Of course, I got up early, had to go to work. Got home just about an hour and a half ago, I think. Something like that. But uh, it was weird because I, I'm i driving to work. I go to get on the interstate, and someone gets off the interstate, turns, and, like, speeds right at me. I barely miss him. Um, and on the way home, some guy walks across the street wearing a black sweatshirt. I don't see him. Almost hit him. And I was like, what the hell? Why are you people acting and driving like that? I mean, it's stupid. Stupid. So I ended up not going to Ben's house, but um, it's because I unloaded the, the truck. Basically, two of us took care of the truck. I unloaded it. Uh, my manager broke down the pallets. Well, I helped. The manager and I broke down the pallets, and we um, sort and got them down. Then we worked all about day again. <sighs> I got a lot of stuff done and ran around, and... um. It's now late at night. I'm probably going to go to bed in a little bit, but tomorrow's going to be a bit different. I'm going to clean up. Uh, I'm going to work on cleaning the spare bedroom because um, I'm actually going to be moving into the spare bedroom. Um, just my bed and my bureau is going to go in there in about a, probably about two, or two weeks because we're going to fix up some stuff in there and um, tear up the carpet, put down some new flooring and uh, repaint the room and I'm going to move my bed in there, I'm going to move my bureau in there and basically that's it um, I'm not going to put my TV in there my computer can come in if I need to work on something but it's it's going to stay in here, uh, the table which I'm using right now as you can see that is actually going to be moved and it's going to be a work table Excuse me, for both mom and myself, um, she's going to move her um, sewing machine down here. And that corner right over there that you can see where my bureau currently is. Eventually, we are going to see about making that into a green screen so I can uh, play around with that. I got some ideas that, um, to, that I want to do with Nick for some different programming. And um, I can just do stuff myself too. Um... So James is at his dad's, with his dad at his grandma's house right now. I have to pick her, him up tomorrow afternoon, most likely. And, uh... <sighs> excuse me. Um, I, uh... I don't know what else I'm going to do. I got some of my tax money in. I got my state. I didn't get too much. I only got about a, about uh, 1200 this year. Um, which is still a good chunk of cash, but, uh... Um, I've gotten more in previous years. Sorry, just checking some stuff out. And, um, you know, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I think I'm going to buy a new TV and buy myself a, a game. And probably put the rest in my savings account and uh, let it sit. Sorry, trying to figure out why the amount of money I had in there wasn't exactly where I thought it would be, but I forgot I bought some stuff. I had to get a couple, I had to get gas last night, and I bought us all sandwiches yesterday. I had some little odds and odds, I just spent, uh, <sighs> just got some uh, snacks. So tomorrow, um, I'm going to, or today, as you're watching this, I'm hoping, um, I have, God, I'm so far behind on my vlogs right now. I've been recording, but I haven't been posting and or 
editing. Let's see. Let's see, my last vlog update was on the 21st. Oh my god. <laughs> I should just rechange my name to, name to perpetually late. Um, 21st was, oh my god, a week and a half ago. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm hoping that by the time you people are watching this, I have um, everything caught up and posted. If not, I'm sorry. I don't mean to, to do this. I've just been so busy that I just haven't had the time to up upload, uh, you know, compile and upload. Um, quick question for you folks out there. If you had the chance to actually make your own TV show, what would it be about? Now, I have an idea. I don't want to say anything because I don't want any of you people out there to rip me off. Because it wouldn't be good. I have a cool idea and I want to do it. Uh, that's part of the reason I, I, I'm trying to get the green screen. It involves things being in more than one place at once. And, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. And uh, once I can get that, that's probably what I'm going to do tomorrow. Um, see if uh, um, my niece wants to go into town, and I need to go and get uh, footage of different uh, of different um, colors of screen to see if I can make the chroma key function work. It's kind of interesting because because all you really need. And it didn't, it always seemed confusing to me, but all you need is a solid background, any color. And what you're doing is you're matching, um, through the program, you're actually, um, basically just washing it out by, by washing out the background color, you're able to put whatever's in the foreground into the picture. So if you have a, like a neon green background, you basically are making the neon green transparent and through through the computer program and allowing whatever's standing in front of it minus, you know, as long as they're not wearing any colors that are just kind of matching up to it, show up in the foreground. And I never understood how the computer did that, but now I do, now that I understand like how it can make a transparent, you know, the the computer, or in the case of older programming and the like, makes the background kind of transparent, so it's just sitting over whatever picture you're putting on. Um, so I'm having a bit of fun with that. I just need to find a color that works, um, a color uh, cloth, and then once I get the rest of my tax money, I'm going to buy, see about buying a big enough bolt to do that. Um, any of you out there actually have experience with the chroma key? Can you recommend a color? I, I've heard that um, part of the reason they use green is that cameras pick it up easier, and it's easier for them to do the transition. Um, also, I mean, the, the re reason they use neon green most likely it's just because no one wears neon green clothing so nothing would go through like that but any gr when you're doing a green screen I guess any green might interfere with it so you know you kind of have to make sure that you don't have uh, the wrong colors on oh, I'm tired I always seem to get better vlogs that when I hit a certain set of tiredness because I ramble on and I talk and I just have lots of weird ideas. Ooh, random thing. I always thought this was cool. I got me a switch drive. Don't make me down with you. Okay, when I start talking like that, I really know I'm getting tired, so I should probably hit the hay soon. Um, I, I, ha I can get Netflix through my Nook, and I've been using my Nook. I just kind of prop it up in the corner of my headboard and I watch. And I've been trying to watch this one ep old episode of Doctor Who. It's actually the first one with John Petrie. I think it's Petrie, Petrie, something like that. Um, 
for about a month and a half now, and every time I watch it, I'll watch five or ten minutes of it, and then I'll pass out, and I'll have to rewind it and watch five or ten minutes, but I might sit down tomorrow and watch all of it just to get it out of the way. Um, wow. I, I, when I seem to ramble on like this and just have kind of... It seems to me that, that the vlogs are a lot more interesting, um, because I actually... Actually, it's like I'm having a conversation with you, but you're not responding because you're not watching. Anyone else confused by that? I don't know. Um, <laughs> oh, boy, it's almost 11. This is the earliest I've done a vlog in a while when after work, but then again, getting out an hour and a half earlier <sighs> helps. So, tomorrow cloth shopping, picking up James, maybe playing a bit of video games, maybe buying a video game. I don't know. It depends on uh, on what time I get out. And uh, I think I might maybe let my niece drive just to let her get a bit more practice. Um, so, yeah. Uh, you guys have a good night. I hope you enjoy your weekend. And, uh, you know, those of you who just stumbled onto me, subscribe, comment, do whatever you need to do. Um, the more you guys talk to me, the more I talk back, the more views I get, possibly the chance, because I, I know it sounds simple, but I'm actually am making some money off of these videos with the, the ad clicks. If you're watching, click on the ad, please, because the more you do that, the more money I can put back in into this because I'm planning on every cent that I get from this is going to go back into buying possibly new equipment you know getting sound effects and stuff like that if I can so you know if you have the chance you don't have to if you don't want to but it would really be cool if you could because it would allow me to do this because I really have fun doing this but I don't have as much time as I would have liked and if I can, once the weather's better, I, I want to start getting out on my days that I can maybe get someone to watch James for a day, or if he's gone and I have an evening off, because I want to get out, get my friends to help me out with some of this stuff, because I have, I have ideas just percolating around in my head that I'd love to get made, but I just don't have time to do it. But if I'm able to make enough money off of what I'm doing to um, maybe get some new equipment and get stuff and maybe I don't know maybe even turn part of my house into a little studio because that would be cool because we're planning on completing our finishing off our carport to make it into a room for me if I can get kind of one corner that I can make into a green corner and if I can make enough money it would be it would be cool I mean I know it's probably not going to happen but you got to have some sort of positive outlook if you don't have the positive outlook you can't do anything because you you just trick yourself into failing and I really don't want to fail anymore I'm sick and tired of failing I want to succeed so I gotta start I gotta keep a good outlook um, well I, I'm trying to let you go and I just can't I ramble on and on and on um, so um, I'm gonna let you go now this time for real this time for real it's really real this time so um, I will see you guys later, and you have a great night. Bye.